Hello, this is Terry Baker with TheHeatGunStore.com. We just want to give you a brief explanation of some of the features of the Heady Heat Gun. The Heady Heat Gun is a variable temperature heat gun. Temperature is controlled by an adjustment on the, on the air regulator. As you close the air regulator, temperature is going to increase within the specified temperature range. As an example, this gun is a 750 degree Fahrenheit to 1000 degree Fahrenheit. With the air regulator open, we're going to be producing roughly 750 degrees. As we close it and go to the maximum temperature, there we'll be, we'll be producing 1,000 degrees. I'm going to turn the gun on, do a brief demo with the gun. You need to allow about 15 seconds for the gun to reach the desired temperature. We're just going to do a little shrink tube demonstration. This is shrink tubing, a surge protector. You can see the material is starting to shrink. I've got a nice fit right here. And one of the nice features on the Eddy Heat Gun is the gun is running at 750 degrees and I'm going to go ahead and turn it up to 1000 degrees. With this double insulated nozzle and shield, I can hang on to the gun. Now if you can see the end of that heat gun, we're producing 1000 degrees. The external temperature of the nozzle is never going to get over around 100 degrees. It will be warm to the touch, but never hot. I'm not going to burn myself or I'm not going to burn any of the material that I'm working with. So that, that really is a critical safety factor for anybody using a heat gun. The gun is equipped with a circular safety stand. I can put the gun down. We're still running hot. We can adjust the gun 180 degrees. It gives us a hand-free operation. Another note, the gun is made of a Lexon, GE Lexon 940. Uh, in the industry, it's basically called a die cast replacement housing. It gives it light weight, but yet the ruggedness and the rigidity to handle. It can be abused, it can be dropped. We could go ahead and, 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 and let this gun fall down. It's not going to break. It, it's made to stand up. The gun is still running at 1,000 degrees. What we ask is that you take the gun, you have a three position toggle, run it back to the cool stage to cool the heating element. This allows all the heat to dissipate from inside the gun and inside the nozzle for roughly 15 seconds, 30 seconds. It'll help protect the heating element. It'll, it'll, it'll make the gun last a lot longer and you're done.